Hey everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to apply your own prosthetic horns. We sculpt these out of polymer clay and do them in a variety of size, shape, sizes, shapes, colors, and textures. So what you'll want to do is we've got our spirit gum that has a very high copal resin content. So even if you're sweating, you're not going to have to worry about your horns falling off. You want to have a nice, clean, sweat, and oil-free surface. Um, also, I always put mine on before I do my makeup. That way you don't have to worry about any powders or anything getting in the way. And you'll just get some onto the brush. And then you'll brush it on pretty generously. You don't want it too thick and goopy. Otherwise, it's just not going to dry properly. And I've painted up one with the spirit gum. And I'm going to go ahead and paint the other. And with these um, horns, if you would experience a buildup of spirit gum, you can either chip it off with your finger or you can use spirit gum remover. Now you can kind of blow on it a little bit. Um, you want to let the spirit gum breathe because if you go, if you just paint it and stick it straight onto your head, um, it's going to have a much more tendency to like slide around. Um, whereas if you let it tack up some, like you can see, you can kind of get it where there's little strings coming off. Um, then it will grab onto your skin and stay without you having to fight with it. And you can determine for yourself whether you want the horns to be rotated up and in or outward or just, you know, personal preference. I personally like them swooping in and up. And so what we're going to do, you can turn that before me up. And I especially like these for gentlemen because as ladies and folks with longer hair, um, you can kind of hide a headband in your hair, but on someone like Randy here who has shorter hair, um, you'd be able to see any kind of band that comes across. So it's had plenty of time to dry up now, and I'm going to make sure I have the style and shape that I want, and then I'm just going to press it onto his skin. My poor neighbor has allergies. Then you have a portrait. Just like that. There you are, guys. <laughs> and that's how we apply uh, prosthetic corns. So, thank you guys for watching. If you want to click like, share, or subscribe to support our efforts to bring you future videos, um, we'd really appreciate that. So, happy cosplaying, and we'll see y'all around. Well, you want to wave bye? <laughs> bye, guys.